whether it be about society, politics, even how they view each other. Ladies and gentlemen, I had the pleasure of interviewing nine wonderful students about how they see themselves, how people see them, and how the media perceives them just as individuals. Well, I hope you enjoy. My name is Morgan. I'm Jonathan. I'm Adam. I'm Raleigh from Queens. My name is Georgia. My name is Leah. I'm Marlon Thurman. My name is Ashley. My name is Kayla. And I like to write books, poetry. People don't know that I'm actually really sentimental sometimes. Even though I may come off one way, I really another. I might be kind of goofy and loud and seem like, you know, I can't be serious. I'm very outspoken and shy and sensitive. I don't like fake people. Um, like, I tend to treat girls like as if they were objects. They don't even know who I am. People gonna think what they gonna think. If, if you feel like crying, cry. I mean, that's how I feel like. I don't feel like that, but hey, be yourself, because you don't want to be like the next person, this person, because it's going to hurt. It's like, man, I'm being me. Why can't y'all be y'all? It's not that hard, guys. Just be yourself. They talk about me, like, why are you talking about me? I'm a nice person. You have to learn to defend yourself and be different from everybody else. Like, I should be like, like treat them with more respect because unconditional love. I really don't like how people, you know, judge me when they don't know me. People judge me from the first time. A lot of people I used to think I'm like really conceited and like um, all extra cocky and stuff. And no, I'm just very confident. And also my teacher said I'm a pugnacious type of person, but I don't think so, you know. I just I just voice I just voice my opinion. That's that's what I do. You no, know, I have attitude problem, like I got a real bad anger attitude problem, but it can kinda of take over me as a person sometimes. I just do what I can do and hopefully I'll be good enough. I'm not one to try to fight people or sometimes I let people say stuff and I don't really say nothing but I'm not gonna be always trying to fight with people or putting the shelf for other people. What's the point? I'm like I'm going to do me, so I don't really care what you say. A lot of people think I'm, like, mean sometimes, like, when they, like, don't mean me. Some people think I'm, like, conceited or whatever. I don't think I'm, like, funny like that. I think I have, like, this weird, retarded sense of humor that not a lot of folks get, or if they do get it, they're like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Some people say I'm a conceited person, but, like I said before, I'm just confident, you know. I. I mean, I don't brag about myself, but I wouldn't say nothing negative about myself. That's just, that doesn't make sense to me. Why would I do that? And if some people find that being conceited, then oh well, there's nothing I can do to change how they feel. I hear a lot, oh, Kayla, you talking about the girl on the basketball team? She, she mean, she always trying to fight. Crazy, love, loving person who, like, is outgoing and just loves to have fun. There's a lot of things about me I would love to change. I think my hair could be a little bit longer. Well, no, just not longer. I just don't like these split ends. I wish I was taller. Maybe a little bit bigger. Um, bigger would be better. But as far as like muscle, you know, I can see kind of skin. Not pretty, like, I'm not happy about my body weight. Like, my weight, for one thing. I wish I was a little bit skinnier than I am. A lot of guys have things to say about like my chest size, but it don't really like bother me. I, cause hey, you know, a girl got do a girl got, and I'm just like, you know, fat and ugly and this is me. And this is me. This is me. And this is me. This is me. And this is me. This is me. And that's me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done. Fuck.